this uh, camp, like Wednesday, a couple, couple day off, two days ago, and then today you're going to train. It's different, and from what I hear, now, you blokes have really enjoyed it. You, just the way you want it. Yeah, it is. I, the focus for us was the quality. This this camp, I, I think the quality has definitely lifted amongst our our, uh, our side, and and the boys are really feeling the, the benefits of it so far. Look, it's a bit of a um, you can't really say we're it's working because we haven't gone out and, and won, but our week's gone fantastic. Uh, uh, it's gone to plan, and, and we're looking at uh, improving every every training session. Have you done more stuff? Obviously, we're hearing more stuff behind closed doors, watching videos and along those lines, and having more discussions about the moves and stuff like that. Is more stuff behind closed doors than obviously previous years? I don't know, mate. That's why the doors are closed. <laughs> nah, look, we we have we. we I won't say we've um, you know toned it down physically. Like we're, we're still. You know, pretty up there in in our um, in our distances and, and our efforts. We just got to make sure our work on the field, uh, away from the field, in meetings is all 100 110 percent, and and going from there, which I really think we have this week. It's been enjoyable, but you know, like I said, our quality has been through the through the roof. Uh, there's a lot of talk made about the, the slow starts. It seems to be the focus of this, uh, this camp anyway. Is that an attitude thing, or how do you physically? Uh, well, I'd, I'd like to say I know the, the formula for it. But I do think it has a little bit to do with your attitude and the way you get get do get about your uh, your business on the field on the training paddock. So we are focusing on that, which is you know, like I said, the quality is lifted, and, and I do think our starts are better. But who knows how it's going to translate to, to next Wednesday? And uh, we know now that we're just going to focus on every day as it comes and our training sessions at the start. Where up? Can you give us how he's settling in? Obviously. It's Talking about the rookies before the, the, the stage for him, he seems like a pretty relaxed sort of bloke going into. But he's you know, known for him as well. I know we touched on it before with McQueen as well. But what do you think? Is he going to be? Do you reckon he's made for the made for this stage? Yeah, mate. The goat. He, he's coming in good. He's yeah. he is a very laid back, casual dude. So I, I think he slotted in well, and you know, he's really fine. And um, he's got a great ability to to be a, a bit of a jokester and then come in and train fantastic. So he's been doing that and. And like I said, well, I think he's slotted in fantastic. He's going really well. Tom, is it Queensland's going to regret only having that spot as a specialist prop in their side? What do you think about that? Or yeah, look, I, yeah, I, you know, it was only a couple of years ago that uh, New South Wales were, you know, putting some locks and back rowers into front row, and uh, people told uh, told them they were doing the right thing, and we were doing the wrong thing by picking front rowers. So we're doing the thing. I, I don't know if, if anyone's got the 100% formula, the correct formula to do things. I, I'd like a, a cut of it, but I, I, there's no doubt. I don't think there's many front rowers that will go with Matt Scott at the moment. So if he's in any side, he's going to be the, the specialist. He, he's the best in the comp at the moment. Just a little one quicker on Hodge. We're here and he's not too bad, eh? He's, he's, he's yeah, okay. he's going to be out in the field today, and you know, hopefully, uh, not palming me in the chest too often. He, he, he'll get out there today and do his bit and uh, hopefully gets through well. He, he's, a, he's a vital part of our team. He, he's a fantastic dude and uh, you know we all know what he's capable of on the field. So you know, to have that uh, to have that outside yeah, in a game and I, I always touch on his aggression as a defender and you know, as a player. He's always good to have in your side.